what it says on the back of here. Okay, we're live. We're live. All right. Hey, we're live again. And we got lit candles to let my hair on fire, just yeah. in case. Oh, I think I... <laughs> oh, Chris Lee is doing a live. Give it a shot. I am. That's weird. Yeah. Let's go ahead and tag me in. Tag. Okay. You've been tagged. And she's getting over just... I locked it. A ten. There we go. That's better. Yeah, that's more gooder. Yeah, that's more gooder. All right, guys. Well, <sighs> thanks for watching. And right now, we are trying a beer call from what is it? Hopworks Urban. What did where did I see that? Uh, Hopworks Urban. Where's the where it says that? You can turn it this way. Hopworks. There it Urban is. Brewery. Urban Brewery. So, <coughs> And it just says H U B at the top of the bottle. So uh, we're we're this one. We're, we're this is a ferocious citrus IPA. <gasps> hey, thanks for joining us, Donna and Knives Million. Hey, all boy. right. Yeah, and uh, James Port Porteous. Hi, we're hi. We June here. Are how are you doing? We're doing great. Yeah, we're gonna do a ferocious citrus IPA. I'm going to read what it says on the back here. So uh, uh, this says it's 40 yeah, IBU. Words. It's a 6.2% alcohol by volume. Woo! So it says, our hazy grapefruit IPA balances citrus forward hops with hard red spring wheat grown at Twin Oaks Farm, uh, San Juan Island. So San this Juan is Island, 1% of the proceeds from this beer benefit environmental organizations. That's pretty cool. So oh, drink Hopworks, nice. do good. So... Yeah, the brewmaster was Christian Ettinger, 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 whatever. I think that's how I, how you say his last name. So, so yeah, <coughs> and uh, here's Sorry. what the bottle cap looks like. It says Hub, Hub. Yeah. which is H U B. Uh, what was it? Hop Hopworks Works Urban, Urban Brewery. Brewery. It looks hazy even through this brown bottle, huh? Yeah, yeah it says something about haze. Yeah, uh, brewed with. <coughs> Grapefruit, organic Grapefruit. malt, barley, and a organic hops. I don't think Served I've ever had a, an organic, organic uh, grapefruit beer. Yeah. So this would be the first time. This is all organic. No chemically induced hormones were made or used in the making of this beer. Not anymore. Ah, Stan Fikes, he's watching. All right, thanks, Stan. What's up, Stan? Hope you like citrus beers. Yeah. Well, let's say. Did you? I hope we like a citrus oh, uh, yeah. IPA. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure we will. I think we've if, had. I think we've had a few. If you've citrus. tried a citrus uh, IPA, yeah, uh, let, us let, let me know in the comment and yeah. what beer it was, so I can yeah. go look for it. Because maybe that's a technique. Uh, think, technique that I really like to drink. <laughs> I know. Um, New Belgium makes a citrus. Uh, I don't know if it's an Indian pale ale, but I know it's just like a citrusy beer. Mm. So, did you already see the IBUs and everything? It's forty. Yeah, forty. That's. That's not bad. Yeah. That's not bad. And a so. 6.2 for an IPA is pretty yeah. high. Yeah. 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 Or uh, for the alcohol, yeah. 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 All right. Let's go ahead and pop it out. Stan says, hey, guys. What's up? Hey. 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 How's it going? Welcome. What, welcome to Stan give it there. Hey, it guys. Shot. How are you doing? That's a weird picture. It kind of looks like a tiki. Yeah. But it's got the grapefruits yeah. for eyes. Yeah. <laughs> It's like hair all the way around it. Yeah. It's almost like a Bigfoot, isn't it? Isn't it kind of like, <laughs> like a Bigfoot? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyways. So let's look at this hazy. Yeah. This hazy pour here. Oh, yeah. Looks like it's, uh, looks like grapefruit juice. <laughs> yeah, it does. Wow. That looks, that looks interesting. Mm -hmm. I picked this up at Fred Meyer. Fred Meyer. They have a d pretty decent um, selection of beer. It's not bad. So I also bought some other interesting beers. So there's some good stuff in the fridge for some more beer reviews. I got a Stone. Yeah. And uh, I was gonna get that one, but the the Citri one did sound yeah. kind of good. <laughs> so I was like, oh, let's go ahead and go with that. One. Okay, here we go. All right. Let's it's see what bad. we get for the aromas. The aromas. Yeah. <coughs> I was expecting to smell a lot of grapefruit. But um, it's not real strong in the grapefruit. <laughs> I mean, hope <coughs> stances look interesting. It does. It does. It does. So it is, the smell is um, not really strong in any way. Just uh, a little bit typical, of a um, typical uh, IPA. IPA. Mm -hmm. 
You can smell the hops. Yeah, so I'm not getting a whole lot of things uh, from good. that. Yeah, a little bit of hops. It smells like a nice, it's gonna, it's, it smells like it's gonna be a refreshing taste. Yeah. So, all right. So, well, let's give yeah. it a taste. Mm. Yeah, and the look of it, that looks, uh, yeah, that looks really thick. It does. It, it yeah. really resembles some grapefruit, I think. Yeah. So, this is like the last beer we had. I forget it what was it was hazy. called, but <coughs> it was very hazy like that. Mm -hmm. It looks really cool. Okay. Yeah. Let's sure. go ahead and give it a shot. See what it tastes like. Yeah. Mm. It's citrusy. Mm hmm. Not so much grapefruit. No, it had it, it has kind of a tropical fruit thing, but not. Mm. I mean, I'm, I'm I know that they put grapefruit in it, but yeah. it doesn't really scream grapefruit. But mm. and and as far as the forty IBU, it tastes less than that to me. Uh, but that's also <coughs> we've been killing yeah. our palates with IPAs for yeah. for a couple of years. Yeah. So forty used to mean a lot. Yeah. <laughs> not so much now. So it, it it to me it tastes mild on the on the bitterness. It does have a nice medium mouth feel, I think. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it goes away quite quickly. Mm -hmm. But the taste, it is, it, I can taste. I can definitely taste the IBU part of it, though. <coughs> a little bit of bitterness. Catch it. Yeah. 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 It's, but so it's, beyond that, it's it, like it does taste low, like forty for sure. Thing. Mm -hmm. Um, the only cool thing about it, or not the only cool thing, but one of the cool things about it is. <coughs> The fact that it is organic, so yeah. those ones out there that are like, I'm only going to get stuff that's organic. So we want to so try one of those uh, semi-stale stale Snyders semi -stale. or a brand new bag. Let's of do the brand new bag. Let's right. uh, take this guy and <laughs> get rid of that. Right guy. there, yeah, we just right did there. that. So, so our theory is is that a salty snack will clear the palate of anything and uh, hopefully make it so that yeah. our next taste of beer. Open will be enhanced. Open our taste buds. Yeah, so we can taste more stuff. And I just try to always pick Snyder's because I really like them. Mm -hmm. And we've done like 200 beer reviews and we should be sponsored by Snyder's by now. No. But we're not. No. So, um, F you Snyder's. Yeah. They put a straining order against us. <laughs> we're not allowed within 200 miles of their facility. I can't email them anymore. Yeah. Just joking, they didn't put a straining <laughs> Mm. I'm, I'm hoping that this will bring out some mm. grapefruit. Mm, 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 it mm, might. Okay. I really want this to be grapefruity. Yeah. So Every the, ounce of the it lacing on the glass is okay. Mm -hmm. It is a higher alcohol, but not not, not crazy high. high. But I mean, it's yeah, higher than your average alcohol by mm -hmm. volume, but not not anything. Yeah. To write home about. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I got the same. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> of, I got a little bit yeah. of the fruity tang at the yeah. end after I swallowed it. Yeah, and it, there's a little bit of the fruit. Maybe the grapefruit kind of lingers on the tip of my tongue after after you swallow it, and then it goes away. Yeah. It's almost a tartness, kind of like um, yes. the peel of the grapefruit. Yeah. Like the, what do they call it, zest or whatever? Yeah, well, that's on the, is that the outside or the inside? I, I, I don't think, know. I don't know. Yeah, it might, yeah, it might but be the outside. all in all, know. all in all, it's got a, it's got a <coughs> nice flavor. Yeah. This would be a great one if it's hot out, which yeah. it isn't right yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> but this would be a great one. Getting cold out. Mm-hmm. But I'm, I it's do. not bad. I, I don't find anything wrong with it. Yeah. I mean, it's. It's uh, something. Do you remember the price of it? Um, I think it was around four dollars. Four dollars. That's not bad, mm -hmm. especially for organic. And um, you know the whole Earth thing about it. Mm -hmm. You know the giving back to Mother Earth. So with the green hair, you know what he reminds me more of is Wolverine. Yeah. <laughs> with yeah. The, with the way his hair is spiked up on the top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wolverine. I don't know who I am. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> don't make me angry. Uh, oh, that's the whole. Never mind. <laughs> same universe. Same universe. It's you, all good. You can't break my bones. Yep. <laughs> In, unless you have adam, any, Ad, uh, adamantium uh, skeleton. <laughs> then yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways. So what do we got, what do we got for comments going on here? Nothing. Just same old, same old. So if you've tried this beer or something else like that, uh, yeah, let us know. Let us know. Hey, hey, Lisa. 
Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let us know if you've tried any cool citrusy, um, anything, any beers, citrusy beers. Doesn't have to be IPA. So, yeah. all right. So, are we gonna down this? There's something that we do is that we we down it to see if a whole bunch of it over our taste buds makes any kind of a difference. See if we can get that extra taste of it. Yeah, um, you never know. Yeah, because it's all just you know grapefruit, and they use malts and barleys they didn't specify which ones one well, did they did they say something about um yeah twin oaks farms on san juan islands <sighs> red spearing spring so this growth. this is kind of yeah. the brewery is in our <clears throat> yeah our neck of the well, woods it's, really it's uh or, or oregon mm -hmm. <laughs> that the, the brewery is at but they they come all the way up here to san juan islands for it so yeah that's kind of it's kind of interesting yeah okay so so Ready to down this stuff? Let's down it. Let's All put right. it down the gullet. October style. October style. <laughs> All, right. All right, cheers. Thanks for watching. Ah. Nope. Same. Yeah. <laughs> exactly the same. I mean, it didn't enhance it at all. All, no. all it was was just a whole colder. lot of it. Yeah. Yeah. So. <clears throat> So it doesn't benefit you to down it, and, and uh, you can just you can just drink yeah. it. At you don't even need pretzels. <clears throat> I was kind of yeah. hoping that uh, you know, yeah, you don't even need pretzels. Yeah. <clears throat> so that's a good experiment, though. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. these pretzels make a difference. Sometimes yeah. slamming it makes a difference. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they do. Yep. All right. So, hey, uh, yeah, let us know if you've tried some beers that are similar to this, and uh, give us some suggestions to go look for. And, yeah. And uh, um, that'll wrap it up. I'm also going to put this on YouTube, which is www.youtube.com forward slash H-A-E-S-T-R-O-M-1. And that'll take us to our Mixed In YouTube channel. There we have plenty of other beer reviews as well. Yeah. So. we got lots of them where we use this green screen. Yeah. To put in stuff. Yeah. And yeah. What we got? Is that Susan watching yep. us? <coughs> yep. All right, Susan, thanks for showing up. Yeah. We just did. Just got done with it, though. We just, Sorry. Yeah, we just we just did a, a Ferocious Citrus IPA. We slammed it. Mm -hmm. Drank it all really, really fast. Well, not all, but we drank about half of this glass really, really fast. Yeah. And it's all it, it tasted the same as yeah. if we just sip it. So yep. that was an experiment. So Okay, so overall, <laughs> the, the look of it. I think I think it, the look is a thumbs up. Yeah, that it was looked, it it looked definitely really hazy pretty and whatnot. Yep. Yeah, so I agree. I think the thumb, uh, thumbs up. The smell of it, it's your typical smelling IPA. But it didn't. Uh, it, it, didn't it didn't smell over, bad. It didn't. Yeah. It didn't really scream anything yeah. special. Yeah, yeah. It was just typical. So that one gets a, a thumbs up, I guess, because it's it's what you would expect. Yeah. Now the taste of it. I was a little uh, underwhelmed. Yeah, yeah. I don't really want to give it a thumbs down, but I don't want to give it a huge thumbs up. Oh, thank you. Dan says, great video, guys. Thanks. Thanks so very much. We try. We really do. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. So, I don't know. It, it gets a mediocre thumbs up. Yeah, it was kind of a meh. Yeah. 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 It wasn't bad. I'd drink it again. You know, yeah. yeah. If I had it, I it would It wasn't an expensive beer, so it's kind of yeah. like if I see that again, it's like, well, that was a waste of time. No, yeah. no it's not. It, but uh, as far as being an, uh, an overwhelmingly fantastic beer, mm -hmm. well, it's not that, but um, but yeah. it still is really, really good. Yeah. And, I, and it's organic, and yeah, yeah it's pretty cool. Yeah. Pretty neat. So it's like supporting. Uh, uh, what, did, what did I read? That it, they, they support. Um, they, they support some environment. Uh, uh, the proceeds. One percent of all the proceeds benefit <coughs> environmental organizations. So, so that's kind of cool. Yeah, cool. So hey, we just helped uh, some environmental organizations. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah. So it makes me feel better. And overall, is a thumbs up. But um, yeah, uh, yeah, not bad. Yeah. So overall, at this point. Up. So we're going to do this again. Um, we do other beer reviews, and I'm putting them on YouTube, and sometimes I put them on Facebook. But uh, that will wrap it up for this live yep. session. And we'll see you again uh, for sure on Saturday at 3, 3 o'clock. So that's what we like to do, Wednesday and Saturday. So 3 o'clock. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys all next time. All right. Later. You got to rejuvenate. Yeah, do it.